obviously it will add a new dimension but uh, but i feel i'm 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 quite old school and tried this in sayed mustaq ali so for us as a team it was quite confusing i mean like your whole tactic kind of a thing uh, because you are not uh, you, you you are more focused pr how can i use that one player Sopil, you last uh, like it's it's almost been uh, close to six years, and you are now making your return to the IPL. Fortunately, and uh, uh, we wanted to know that uh, during this entire period of six years, six years is obviously a very long time, and people elo- uh, evolve a lot. Okay, so we wanted to know that. Can you talk us through that? Uh, how how do you think you have exactly changed as a player over these years? Changed a lot. I mean, like firstly, I was doing really well in domestic cricket, and as, as I told you before, also 2019, 2020, I was the top three all rounder in white ball cricket. Though I did not get the opportunity for the IPLs and all that, but I was growing as a cricketer. But the thing which changed was last year itself. I mean, last year was. I mean, last year, if I say it is this year starting. So that has really made me tough as a. person as as a cricketer i mean like I, I, i'm i'm very close to deepak hooda because we used to play for same state so i mean the time with him during the ipl i go to two and a half months this, this season uh, the, I, uh, yeah so this season so i mean like those that was like uh, being i mean like being uh, finding myself i mean like these he and me are more like same i mean like we we play the cricket game we play the game or the attitude of us is just the same being very hard into the phase kind of a thing so which i had lost i mean like which i had lost because i i, I mean like i was going to a different phase of life or 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 the game but since i met him again so that was i mean like that uh, that actually brought me back and I mean, yeah. I mean, I started to play with with my attitude. I mean, like that high intensity, rough into the face. It doesn't matter who who you are. I mean, I mean, like if we step on the field, it doesn't matter who you are. I'm I'm the boss. I'm 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 the boss out here, kind of a thing. So you, I mean, like in that you fail, you fail. I mean, it doesn't matter. But over there, I'll dominate. I mean, like that kind of a thought process that has really helped me this this. Like specific goals that you have in mind personally that you want to accomplish in the upcoming IPL edition. There's no specific goal, but yeah, I just want to play, man. I mean, like uh, I have a couple of things in my mind, but yes, uh, for now I just want to go there and show what I am. Do you think, as a player, this entire rule change is going to, you know, add a new dimension to the format and to the Indian Premier League? Obviously, it will add a new dimension. But uh, but I feel I'm 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 quite old school. I mean, like I like eleven players playing, and those I mean, like those players only performing or having a beating or whatever. So this I mean, like we tried this in Sayed Mustaq Ali. So for us as a team, it was quite confusing. I mean, like your whole tactic kind of a change. Uh, because you are not uh, you 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 are more focused. PR. How can I use that one player? Uh, whether to use it or not, and if to use it, when to use it. So it is for us as a domestic team. It was quite difficult. It was like quite. Uh, so you can say, it, yeah, it was difficult for us. So I don't know how it will go in IPL. Obviously, there are uh, more. Uh, so so more big minds, you can say. So I guess. Uh, there's so nothing harm in trying once. Let's see how it goes. But so, but in domestic, it was tough. Right. So uh, actually, the thing is that I mean, we see uh, all, all these years we have seen the fact that a lot of young, uncapped Indian players they get picked up at the option, but do not get ample opportunities, and they often get benched during the entire season. So. Uh, 
I mean, do you do you feel that this uh, impact player thing will keep them on their toes and uh, they can be in the reckoning for an opportunity at any point during the league? Hundred percent, hundred percent, because you have different skills. So yes, I mean, like, uh, I mean, they, I, I mean, they, I, I mean, so if we give an opportunity, obviously, if it's a similar thing, so rightly said, if we keep you on toes, yeah, you will uh, at any moment of time you will be in the game. You never know. I mean, that kind of thing. So yeah, it is quite good for the uncapped players in a way to get into the game. So, uh, Sopnil, you are making a return after six years, and obviously, like you uh, yourself have mentioned already, that a lot has changed over the years. Do you uh, like when you look back at your career? Uh, do you have any particular regrets? Uh, do you see it that way, or you are someone who like uh, just does not believe in that? So. Oh. I just have only one regret that is of 2019-2020 that I'm like I'm mentioning for the third time. Sorry about that, but I mean that is the only regret because I did extremely well in that and I did not get in the title contract. So because that is for us uh, a platform to showcase what we have. Other than that, no. I mean like everything happened happened for the good. I'm 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 actually happy where I am. I'm I'm happy where my cricket is. I know. I mean, like uh, good. I mean, like good days are here. Uh, so, Apnil, you bagged a nine-wicket haul against Nagaland recently, and also a four-four in the last Ranji game against Odisha. Uh, but uh, apart from that, the other thing that actually stood about you was the way you contributed with the bat, okay, and uh, uh, and scored two half centuries. Can you can you talk us through the reasons behind your batting success? So when we bat, I'm 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 playing as a batsman. When we bowl, I'm playing as a pure bowler. So I mean like, so I mean like, so that is my mindset. So I mean like, so when we, so uh, I mean like, uh, so during practices as well, I train I train that way. I have to be a pure bowler. I have to be a pure batsman. So that is where I mean like I feel things are now getting synced rightly at the right time. Where if you see me. You will say he's a pure batsman. If I bowl, you'll see. Uh, you'll say he's a pure bowler. So that is the way I have trained myself, and that is the way I have been training. Uh, so, Apnel, uh, our last question to you is that uh, over the years, have you worked more on your mental side of the game, or more on the technical aspect of your game? And you are someone who is more into getting, uh, like, getting more into the technicalities of your. Uh, batting as well as bowling, or do you think that if someone nails the mental aspect of the game, then that person is sorted? What do you think is more important? I feel both. So both are equally important. I've trained, uh, I've trained skillful. I mean, like skill wise as well as uh, my mind. So over the period of years, I mean, like because uh, I felt that if if uh, if my skill is not there. I mean, like, if my skill is there, if my mind is not there, I'll suffer. And and if if my mind is there, my skill is there, I'll still suffer. So I feel that I felt as a personal, I mean, like, uh, it's my personal experience. I felt that I had to train my my both aspects just to be here where I am. So, so mentally, mentally where I am, it is. I mean, like, it's. All about, I mean, like how I trained myself during, during, I mean, like skill wise as well as my mind. I feel both are equally important. All right, Sopnil, it was an absolute pleasure talking to you, and it was an absolute riveting chat. Thank you so much for turning up for this interview at such a short notice, and we really appreciate your time and effort. And thank uh, you. Yeah, thank you. yeah. Uh, thank we you. wish you all the very best for your upcoming Ranji Trophy game, and I hope that you bag a truckloads of wickets in the upcoming IPL edition, and also score a lot of runs. Surely, hundred percent. There's no doubt about it.